Welcome back to Andy's Guides. In today's video, we are going to show you how to fix the diagnostics policy service is not running on Windows 7, 8, 10, and 11. Let's begin. Now, the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here on Windows Click on the create one option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Now if you are encountering the diagnostics policy server is not running error on your Windows PC whether it's Windows 11, 10, 8 or 7 you can follow these steps to resolve the issue alright because we uh, be, be mindful that the diagnostics policy service is crucial for detecting and troubleshooting issues with their system. All right. So number one option is I need you to press the window plus key R button and type in services dot MSC and click on the OK button. Now, once you are here, I need you to hover to where it says diagnostics policy service all right right click on it and go to properties and make sure that the start type is going to be automatic all right because what will happen is this will enable to fix the problem and the issues all right and all i have to do is click on okay and after that is i need you to open the command prompt and click as run as administrator now here on cmd i need you to enter the following uh commands all right just so just follow along now from here i need you to type in net space local group space administrators slash space slash add network service right now when you press enter what will happen is some users have fixed the diagnostics policy service not running error by granting admin privileges to the local and network services all they have to do is just press enter try to restart your pc to see if that works now the next option is to reinstall the network adapter card driver and again go to the uh, run dialog box by clicking on windows plus r button and from here what we need to type in is dev mgmt which is dev management and i need you to press an ok and there's going to be a new pop-up window that will appear now i need you to double click the network adapters right here and from there select the uninstall device option all right and try to uh, scan for hardware changes at the uh, top of to install the driver and again try to restart your pc if that works now, finally, if none of the above steps work, you might want to go here at the Microsoft Support Center. And from here, choose the product that you need help with. And that's going to be with the Windows 10, 11, 8, 7, regarding about fixing the diagnostic policy server. Because when you get a hold of one of the customer support staff, they may have troubleshooting steps and technical guidelines that we don't know that they could give you in terms of the diagnostic policy server is not running on windows alternatively you can also run a system file checker by going to the command prompt as admin and type in this command when you run the deployment image servicing tool by typing the command and from there try to fix and scan and restart your computer to see if that works okay thank you so much for watching we will see you in the next video